In this video I will be opening 1000 Lunar Chests for the gear I'm gonna use full Torva and uh, basically Max Melee. I think you need Stab, Slash and Crush weapon so for Stab I'm gonna use Sami Hasta for Slash I'm gonna use Abyssal Tentacle and uh, for Crush I'm gonna use Elder Maul. I might change it during the video I'm not sure how this is gonna work but uh, we will see. This video took me over 100 hours to make, so I will really appreciate it if you could give the video a like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy my content. Some info you guys should know about before I start the video is that I'm gonna kill all three bosses before I loot a chest, regardless if I have completed a set or not. There is no need to bring own supplies while doing Perilous Moon, everything you need can be made inside the cave. And there is no need to use overhead protection prayers while killing the bosses. With that being said, let's open some chests. I haven't looted the chest after the quest completion, so uh, I think I can claim this one now. Yes, I can. Not bad. Nice. Eclipse Moon Tassets. That took only six chests. Damn. There's the first blue mons. Armor. That's very good. We need that for the master clue step. Damn. Nice. Another blue mon. Blue moon. Spear. Well, it's the first one, but uh, second blue moon piece. I only need two more. And there's 50 chests so far. A little nice milestone. Yeah, nice. Only need one more piece to complete the master stash unit. And many people probably wonder how I start a run. So I will show you guys pretty quickly you will enter at this place then you run up the the north uh, eastern corner when you go to the eastern corner you will arrive here then you run all the way and i'm using only rope for uh, to catch the salamanders so when i'm starting i go to this place and there's a hunter uh, hunter place once I've catched maybe three or four, I go back again and I go to this place. And then I gather some vials of water and I collect some grubby saplings, the moonlight grub. Use the um, Tesla motor and you get the moonlight potion. Once I have the supplies with food and moonlight potions, I go to this place. I marked one tile here and uh, label it as Eclipse Moon, just to know what kind of boss this is and what kind of style I have to use. So I will show one run just to show you guys how I do it.
Let's see. This is going to be chest number 100. Never lucky. There it is. Full blue moon set. That's nice. Very nice. That means that we can get the dupe blue moon uh, gear, I think. So uh, let's not hope we get that. Damn, blood moon tacits. Not bad. Now we have all the tacits. Very nice. Hmm. Yep, there's um, a dupe. Shit. Oh well. Okay, so I, I am currently 60 chest dry. Please, just give me one item. And there is chest number 200. 800 to go. Finally. <laughs> Eclipse at Lattle. Nice. Are you kidding me? Third blue moon spear? Oh my god. Nice. Good, good. Can we get back to back? Never lucky. Blood Moon Helm. Nice, nice. And we are now at 300 chests. Oh, we have broken our old dry streak record, which was 64. Now we are 66 chests dry. Well, it seems like the drop rate for an item when you kill all three bosses isn't 1 in 14, it's actually 1 in 18.67. Or we can round it up to 1 in 19, I guess. So, um, yeah, I thought I, I was very dry, but uh, well, I'm kind of dry. Still dry, because uh, I'm five times over the drop rate for an item right now, so... Rip me. I go 97 chest dry to just get the dupe. Come on, dude. I'm not sure what the meta will be now because you don't get uh, an extra roll when you kill all the three bosses. So I'm not sure if I uh, should do all the bosses when I have already completed the blue moon. But uh, I'm gonna do 1000 chests anyway. So uh, hopefully I will have the collection log green logged by them. Yes, 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 yes. That's nice. That means we have full blood moon set as well. Now we only need uh, eclipse. I think you need the chest plate and the helmet. Chest number 400. Can I get something? We can't. Rip. Oh yes, only one more item to go. Wow, that means I have green logged it. Moons of Peril. Damn, nice. Well, I'm still gonna do 1000 chests, but uh, that's that's very good. Ooh, nice, Blood Moon Tacits. Blue Moon Chestplate, that's my third one. We are close to actually getting another full blue moon set. We just need the, the helm now. That's nice. Back to back, nice. And we are officially halfway on only 500 to go. Chest number 600. Spear number 4. What the hell? <laughs> back to back. Nice, nice. Seven hundred high hitter and fortified. Nice. 
they released the uh, combat achievements today, so probably I'm gonna get all of them completed before this uh, this grind is over. Luna Triplet, Perilous, Novice, and Champion. Oh, that's for the kill count. Or you had to loot it a couple of times. Nice. Not bad. Blood Moon chest plate again. That's my third one. Nice. Back to back. <laughs> nice. Blood Moon tacits. I think that's the last one. Or Peril Moon. Yes, it is. Nice. Nice, nice. Eight hundred Eclipse Moon chest plate number five. Chest plate number six. Jesus Christ. Blood Moon chest plate. That is number four. And there is chest number 825, which means I am now rank 1 for Iron Man on the high scores. That's actually my first ever rank 1 ever in this game, so this is... Uh, it's pretty nice, yeah. Do... I'm not gonna even say that name, I have no idea how to pronounce that, but that's my second one. Hmm, Blue Moon Helm, that's my second one, that's nice. We only have one item that I only have one of, which is the Eclipse Atlatl. If we get that, we have a um, dupe in every single set. And there is loot from 1000 Lunar Chest complete. And the loot comes out to be... 114 mil. Nice. During looting 1000 Lunar Chest, I earned about 9.7 mil XP in total. My worst dry streak was 97 chests. I got, I think, three back-to-back -back drops and zero multi-drops. Time used per chest was about six minutes, which comes out to be about 10 chests for each hour. And total time used is 100 hours, give or take. So, uh, and I used about two plus hours gathering supplies. I think that's about right. I think maybe between one and two hours. But before I end the video, we need to check the collection log. I have, of course, green logged it. 13 out of 13. 1000 chests. And uh, I basically got dupes in every single item except uh, Eclipse at Lattle and only 250 dogs. Yeah. Nice.